Hi guys, hi guys, it's your girl Alicia Ray, and I'm back, 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 what another entrepreneur video. Ew, I hate doing that, but you guys love it, so I'm going to continue to do it. But today, let me, <clears throat> should have fixed myself up better if I got in this camera, but I'm going to try not to edit this video, so I'm going to try to get through this video. Um, I'm rocking on my lips today. Foxy, um, I think it's Foxy. Oh my God, I forgot the name, but yeah. Um, yeah, so I wanted to come and talk to you guys. I told you guys in my last live that I was going to sit down and talk to you guys about my one year anniversary. So I wanted to get balloons and wine and all that, and I waited till last minute. So today is Wednesday. I'm going to do all of that um, because I'm ordering everything off of Amazon except the wine. I'm going to do all of that Saturday. So look out for like a little vlog. I'm going to get my, I'm going to be in Virginia with my brothers and my sisters Saturday. So I'm going to get them to record it. It's going to be somewhat like a vlog. I'm going to do like pictures, videos and stuff like that. I'm going to get um, 15K because I made 15K in my first year of business. So I'm going to get a 15 I mean, a one to five. I'm going to see if I can find just like a 15K balloon on Amazon. And I'm going to get some wine. I'm going to get some confetti. I'm going to get all of that. And we're going to celebrate because it has been a long, 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 hard road. So before I get into this video, let me tell you guys about the new items I have on my website. Like I always tell you guys. So I have these new little kits. These are these lip gloss starter kits, but these are for my little boss babies. These are for like my younger girls that's like 9, 10, maybe like 7 to like 14, 15, 16. It has the little um, bottles. They're so cute. And it has the pink 15 ml tubes. And it comes with the color of your choice, a 5 ounce. Um, you get three pipettes and one syringe, 60 ml syringe. It's so stinking cute. So if you're looking to start a business for your niece, daughter, friend, all that guy, daughter, I have <clears throat> one guy, daughter, and best believe I'm going to be making her own little kit when she's only, she's about to turn one next month. But best believe when she get a little older, auntie, auntie slash godma, I'm going to make her, make her a little kit so she can sell to little friends. So <clears throat> I thought that was a really cute idea for my young girl and that kit is called Boss Babies, my little bosses. Um, this is my new logo. So I'm going to be doing a video just talk about my new logo, how I'm rebranding and stuff like that. So I'm going to do a separate video because I have so many items to show you guys. But this video here, I just want to show you guys a little sneak peek of the new items. But this video just want me strictly talk about my first year in business. Um, <clears throat> let me show you guys. I screenshot it off my website because I'm using my phone to record. But our first year in business, baby. And this is included in... All the sales I made off my website, all the sales, um, all the people that invested into my website, like family, I have family that invested into, not my website, people that invested into my business, like I have my brother, my mom, my, of course my husband. So I added all that and I calculate everything and this is how much I made. I made 15K. 15k in my first year of business i'm so 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 thankful for that i keep i keep beating myself up because like ah, oh, you could have did better you could have went harder you could have did this get it did it could have did that but i'm thankful i'm so 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 thankful for you guys i'm thankful for you guys for supporting my brand i think you guys for rocking with me when i even didn't believe in myself mm, excuse me i think you guys were rocking rocking with me when i didn't even believe in myself. I thank you guys for um, sending me motivational posts. I thank you guys for buying for me. I thank you guys from su for supporting my brand. I When I first started my business, I didn't think that anyone would buy for me. I didn't think anyone would support me because I had a learning disability. I didn't think anyone would rock with me because of how I look. You know, I'm not the average social media looking girl. But hard work and dedication... First, first, God, family support, and hard work cannot be beat. I'm telling you, like, I pray for this. I cry for this. I ugly cry for this. Um, 
I even had times, go out, Bubba, uh-uh, go out. I'm sorry, that's my son. I even had times where people didn't believe in me. Like, people would tell me that I would never be nothing. Because of my learning disability, guys, it, it has been a long road like a long journey like um growing up i i had to learn i have learned i didn't have i have a learning disability i have dyslexia dyslexia is when you see things backwards you just don't learn like everyone else you don't learn go on the people pace i learn in a different type of environment like i'm real 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 good when it comes to techie stuff but when it comes like the math and work work book work <laughs> and talking i also have a speech delay like i also struggle with my anxiety like <clears throat> when i'm super super excited i stumble over my words a lot um i think about my words a lot and they come out really really wrong and just crazy and i was just afraid of starting my journey i thought people would like never support me because it's like who wanted to support a girl who has a learning disability i feel like you don't know what you're talking about you shouldn't run a business so I am just thankful, guys. Like, I always been told, I always dreamed of having my own business. I, I thought I was going to be selling hair. My first goal was I wanted to sell bundle. Then bundles. Then I got into, I told you guys, at 14, my sister-in-law introduced me to makeup. I struggled with very, very, very low self-esteem when I was in, like, middle school um, because I was picked on for being overweight and I was also picked on for having a learning disability and being in a special class and all that. So I never had the confidence that I needed to run a business. I right, confident I need to just go out here and just, you know, talk to you guys like I have all the confidence in the world. So I never in a million years thought I would be here. Like I, my teacher told me that the only thing I was going to be able to do with my life is lip burgers i was told that because i couldn't read a full sentences which i'm better now i can i can read now i still struggle i'm not gonna lie i still as me being an adult i still struggle and i can't help that i was born with a learning disability like it just it is what it is so i learned to cope with it but um you know it's just since i was like seven i've been told that you would never be this you would never do this you will never amount to nothing. And it was never my parents. My mom and my dad was big on, I told, I always told them I wanted to be a lawyer. And it was like, you go be that lawyer. You got all the tools. You can do it. It's just going to be a lot harder for you. But, well, hard work, you can do it. But, like, I'm trying not to get emotional because I hate getting on the internet and crying. But y'all don't understand the mess I've been through like I was told that I would never like I just never amount to nothing like even growing up in school my teacher would hit hit on me slap me pinch me bite me because I couldn't read and I always punished myself for having a learning disability because I always thought something was wrong with me but Hey guys, if you have a dream, do not let weak-minded people stop you from doing what you want to do. I don't care, like, what it takes. I don't care, like, just keep pushing. I hate getting on the internet and crying, but you guys know this, everything I've been through. What, and not up here to, like, have a pity party and, like, have you guys feel bad for me, but... I've been told something and I've been told that I will never do this. I wasn't capable of functioning like a regular person. Even if my mom had complications in her um, pregnancy. They told her that I would never function like a normal human human being. And it just it's just a lot like for me to and there's time i wanted to give up i gotta tell you i didn't start really getting sales until like may of this year like i was getting so but it, it wasn't consistent as it is now and it's slow again but i'm thankful for the experience that i have like i'm think I, i'm proud to say alicia ray long may 15k
Like, y'all don't understand. Y'all don't understand my struggle. Excuse me. <sighs> y'all don't understand. Like, I noticed some was like, girl, you only made 15K. That is nothing. But to me, it's everything. I wish my dad was still here to see because my dad will always cheer me on. Like, you can do anything to put your mind to. You could be the president of the United States if you try. <laughs> But I'm sorry I'm up here crying and but I just never thought I would be here. Like I never thought I was capable of doing any of this. Like people have told me so much in my life I wasn't so I believe that I wasn't I gave like I cut a struggle with anxiety i struggle with depression as many times i gave up i see other youtubers just blossoming out i just look at it like I, I, me i can never i used to say i can never be that person i can never be in that position i'm not pretty enough i'm not smart enough i i can i can read but it takes me a longer process than a normal person because when i see letters when i see words i see them backwards and it takes me a minute to get it so I always told myself, like, they're right. Like, I, even in school, I told a teacher I wanted to go to college. She'd laugh and say, well, me having a learning disability, I don't even deserve to, to go to college. And there's a lot of things I regret. I allowed those teachers to get in my head to the point that I dropped out of high school when I was in 11th grade. Um, I don't know if you guys know, if you have a learning disability and you're in school, you don't get a high school diploma. You just get a paper that say, thank you for attending school for 12 years. So I had teachers that told me that it's all we deserve, kids that have learning disability. Um, imagine if I would have took that and just stuck with it. Like, I'm glad I had the parents I had. I'm glad I had my older sisters, my older brother. Like, they was like, I'm glad I also had my husband. Like, my husband has been thugging it out with me my husband has invested so much money into my business my mom has invested money my sister has invested money my sister-in-law my brother has invested money like it's it's been a long road a long road i didn't think i it's so many times i wanted to give up i was just like maybe i should just stop it's not making a difference in no one life and making lip gloss won't get you nowhere and i've been told when i first started this people laughed at me it was like girl you making lip gloss what type of money you gonna make making lip gloss so and i believe that and there were so many times i was like okay i'm not gonna start my business because there's so many people doing it who would notice me like who would see me who would want to work with me who you know i'm just a black girl who has a learning disability like why would anybody want to work with me so you guys have to be careful what you speak over your life. What you speak over your life will come to exist it. And I spoke that over my life for a long time. Go out, baby. No, go out. I'm sorry, guys. When I started speaking, when I started speaking, hold on, guys. What's that? I'm sorry. When I started speaking positive things, good things over my life, um, every day I wake up, I speak, I am beautiful, I am capable, I am worthy, I am a, a child of God, I I can do this, I got this, God will give me everything I need to make things, like this rebrand I'm doing my business, I'm like, God, how I'm going to do this, where I'm going to get this, I'm, and I'm just, now I'm just like, God just order my steps, like, um, we're going to go in this direction, we're going to go in that, that direction, so I ask God, like, I told myself I want to meet. Yeah, I made 15K from, I guess my business started taking off around May of this year. So, all of that started calculating really in May to now. So, and also, when I first, first, first started my business, it was booming. It was going really, really good. Especially with the support of my family and a lot of you guys here on my YouTube channel. You guys off my YouTube channel have really been rocking with me. Like, I'm also going to be doing a giveaway I know I say this in every video. I'm get. I, I have to get out of this mind space. Like, oh, I need to make this money, make that money. I'm gonna get back into the mindset where I want to do my giveaways every single month. I want to give back to people. I want how I'm feeling right now. <clears throat> I want another young black girl to feel how I'm feeling. That been told they couldn't do this, they couldn't do that. I want a young mom to, you know, I want 
everyone around me to have this feeling because I did it. Like I did a, I went, I went hard. I did a whole year of my business and I wanted to give up. So many days I wanted to give up. So many days I was just over it. So many days, like the enemy was speaking to me. It was like, Chloe, it's useless. You're wasting your time. Why are you doing this? And I'm, I'm so glad I have God in my family and you guys supporting me. Like, you guys keep me going. You guys be sending me messages every day, email every day. And it's nobody but God because you guys always send me motivational messages and telling me how I inspire you. Like, that keep me going. Like, I could be laying in the bed depressed, sad, and somebody right on my YouTube page be like, girl, please don't stop because you are doing this. This is why I'm doing it. I'm seeing you doing this. I'm continuing to do this. So that makes me keep going. Like, that me, all right, get out your feelings. I'm learning that my business is not for me. My business is to help others. My business is to inspire others. Like, each and every day I'm learning my business. The purpose for my business is not for me. It's not for me to profit money. Of course, I want, you know what I'm saying? I need the money to continue to keep going with my business. But I really want to make Ray Lush's Beauty a foundation of helping young girls. Like, pushing people who have learning disability. You guys can just see how some of those teachers treat kids that have learning disability. Like, they can, those teachers, not all of them, some most teachers I had, they can kill your spirit. Like they can say some hurt, or they can say and do some hurtful things that will kill your spirit. And a lot of those teachers, they kill my spirit. Like they, every dream that I had, they made make sure they killed that dream. And there was a point I allowed them to. I and I feel so like dumb. Like how can you ever allow? A person like that that don't matter to your life that don't do nothing to affect your life like my dad was just telling me don't allow a person that don't do nothing for you to have that much power over your being like over your whole entire like existence and i'm learning each and every day other thing, things things other things like now when i see other things on youtube like sometimes i have to step back from youtube because i have to make sure um I'm not allowing other people or other things to influence me that I need to be doing better. Like, okay, I'm like, yeah, I made 15K. In, in my head, I'm like, I could have did better. I, I need to do better. That's not good enough. Like, what is that? And I'm like, no, you need to be proud. Celebrate this moment. And I was ashamed to celebrate it because I don't want to make other people feel bad about, you know, them making like $10, $5. But guys, I was there. There was a point, there were months, I won't make nothing. Nothing. I was still putting so much money into it like now i feel like my business is slowing down my customers are slowing down but I, i'm like okay god thank you for this downtime i can rebrand i can reinvent to ray Lush's beauty like i want a meaning a true meaning behind ray Lush's beauty so i revamp i'm gonna tell you guys more about that in my next video but i revamp ray Lush's beauty all over it has a beautiful meaning behind it as you guys can see, the meaning is butterflies, like, and it's just like of being free, like being free to express yourself, being free, me, Alicia Ray, long, what a learning disability, and I'm okay with that. Like, you can rise above that. That do not define you. So, the butterflies are just like spreading your wings and just, you know, taking that leap of faith, um... Yeah, like I'm sorry I'm always up here preaching, but on my channel, we represent God heart. So that's what we're going to talk about. I'm sorry if you get sick of that, but I believe in God. And God has helped me through so many situations in my life. He has brought me a long way. You guys see this cheerful, happy person. This person that's not afraid to get up here without makeup. Like I haven't always been this person so i'm here to tell you guys keep on pushing that dream i don't care if you make one cent from that business keep pushing if you keep going imagine like you know i keep telling myself some days like i told somebody here on my youtube channel someone was like i really don't want to do this no more because there's so many people just doing it just to do it and they're out shining you know that was my mindset i had to get out of that mindset you guys see how many bread brands at every store, Walmart, Food Lion. You see how many breads there are? You see how many artificial, like there's a, a real bread and there's an artificial bread. So think of that as your motivation. Like 
you could be the next Fenty Beauty. You can be the next Gucci. Like, keep going. Keep going. If this is what God has for you, baby, nobody else got nothing on you. You know what I'm saying? We all doing the same thing, but God has us all in different positions. Like, we all live in different cities. You know what I'm saying? There's a place for all of us in this industry. So, I'm thankful for the things God has been doing in my life. Um, you know, I'm claiming that we're going to hit, we're going to be a six-figure business and beyond. We're going to be millionaires. We're going to be billionaires. And even if it's not, even if it's not me selling base or whatever, I, I'm where God need me to be because I'm touching people's life through lip gloss. I'm inspiring people. Like what? Like I would never in a million years thought little old me, like me can inspire somebody like who not i so i'm where i need to be in my life i'm in the right position i need to just learn how to be more patient and work with what i have and that's what i'm doing i'm in the moment praying to god asking him to lead me which road i need to go i know i'm in the position i need to be in like right here i'm right where i need to be and i'm just like god lead me lead me like Whatever path, I'm, I, I know I'm where I need to be because it's inspiring people. And when I do it, like I told you guys when I was filling those tubes, like it, it brought me so much joy filling some tubes. And I'm like, okay, I love doing this. Like if I had to do this for the rest of my life, I wouldn't even mind. And, you know, I got in the mindset of just like, oh, let me go fill these tubes. Oh, let me go fill these jars. They probably won't even sell. So, just be careful when you speak over your, over your life. Like, when I fill these tubes, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to sell all these tubes. Yeah, when I <laughs> make a new, like, little little kit I did, I'm going to sell out all these kits. Like, just speak life. Like, I just been praying and praying. And God been telling me, I, I need to speak, like, as the word everyone using now, manifest. I need to continue to speak these things over my life. I will level up. I will double 15K. I am capable. I am beautiful. I am wonderful. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. We hit 15K in our first year of business. Only up from here. It's, it's been a long road. Like, I'm telling you guys. Do not. Mason? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I don't want to edit this video. I'm sorry. He's right there getting into everything. I'm trying to hurry up and just film this so I can get this up today because I should have been filming this. But I, I've been so busy rebranding. Like, I've been focused. So, I'm sneaking in this video. I kind of forgot. Like, I've been so caught up in rebranding and doing other things. Homeschooling my child. I kind of forgot. Forgot today was my first year of business to my husband remind me. And I was like, you right. Like, excitement. Like, let me go check my analytics. Like, what, 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 what? You know? But yeah, I'm so happy. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry for the crying. I know people are like, ugh, you shouldn't be crying. I don't care what nobody got to say. I just want to share my testimony with you guys. I want to let you, I really want you guys to get from this video. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Like, I don't care how it's looking. Keep pushing. Keep going. <sighs> Re-up your brand. If you feel like things not working, switch it up. Like, keep going. I'm telling you. Keep going. So, yeah. It's only up from here, guys. Thank you guys so much. I'm working on my brand. I am bettering my brand. I'm bettering myself as a person each and every day to, you know, provide you guys better content. I'm doing... Like, I'm a little discouraged by my YouTube. I'm like, ugh. My YouTube is not where I want it to be, but I, I've been slacking, and I'm so, so sorry. I've been in my feels, which I'm getting out of that, and I'm just going to do better. I'm just going to continue to go hard because there are some people watching. There are some people waiting for me to post. There are some people like, sus, where's the content? But I'm back, and I'm better. I'm out my feels. <laughs> I ain't in my feels today, and yeah, we're just going to keep on thriving. We're just going to remember this name. Ray Lush's Beauty. Remember, remember, 
this logo because you will see it in every single store. You know what I'm saying? I'm working on get my brand. Well, let me not speak on things. Let me just let you guys, you guys going to see it. You know what I'm saying? You're going to see it because this name, you see it, will go far. I speak it. I decree it. I claim it. Ray Luscious Beauty will go far in the beauty industry and beyond that. Amen. In Jesus' name. We claim it in Jesus' name. No other man name. Jesus' name. Jesus' holy name. Amen. And that's on that. Period. I love you guys. Keep pushing. Inbox me. DM me if you need some motivation. Like, keep pushing. Don't you stop that business, girl. Don't you give up. Don't. Don't do it. Don't give up. You better not give up. You better not stop. Wipe those tears, girl. You got this. I'm telling you. Girl, boy, whoever you are, man, woman, you got this. You are great. You are wonderfully made. You are designed. If this is for you, God is for you. Who could be against you? Who? I wait. Who? Who? Oh, okay. So yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna leave and show you guys that I gotta hurry up because uh-uh, close the door, boy. I just hungry. My son, like, he has to be seen so bad. That little fifteen k period proof. Come on, don't hit the thing. Come this way. Come here. Since he has to be seen, tell my YouTube family hi. Uh -huh. Put this down. Say hi, guys. Hello. Um, don't eat with food in your mouth. I mean, don't show them your food in your mouth. Wave. Say hi. Hi. Stop. Wave. Say hi. Hi. Look. Say hi. Hi. Say bye, guys. Bye, guys. Say thank you so much for watching. Period. Period. Period, boo. Okay, bye guys. I love you guys. And please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And you will see you I will see you guys in my next video. As, okay, hush, hush. Let me talk. I have an inventory haul coming up. I have so much stuff coming in the mail. I'm waiting on some more things. So I may do a part one and part two. Let me know if you guys want to see that. This video will be uploaded today. But yeah. And I also will show you guys behind the scene of me rebranding my business. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. And all that tea. So, yeah. I love you guys. And I will see you guys. Yeah, And my... Baby, stop doing that. You, make, you look crossed out. <laughs> we'll see you guys you in my next video. Okay. Bye. Give him a chip. Give him a chip. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, guys.